What's up y'all, Scarberry here with day 14 of my playthrough of King's Quest 3. This is day 32, I think 32, of my 100 Days of Gaming for Extra Life. Links down below. Please donate. It's an excellent cause. I'm still sick, so my voice is rough and hurts. Um, but we are going to attempt... to just teleport up, see if that works. Not quite what I wanted, let's see. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> Where is this? I think, I think this is good, right? Look at map. Um, I skipped a whole square. <laughs> Maybe that's bad. I don't know. Hold on. What was it? F8. Okay, wait. Hold on. Let's probably save. We're on the mountain. Up. <laughs> Well, that's not the worst thing that could have happened. Yeah, okay, so I just filled in my map. Uh, function F8. Oh wait, can I use a map to teleport? Um, function F6. I did it. Okay, so now that we know that I needed to keep my essence intact, um, I don't want to use the the fly, or do I want to use the eagle? Eagle is more majestic, so let's just have it at the ready, so that when we climb up, we are just ready to go. Oh no! Okay. <laughs> the abominable snowman seems quite confused by this. He stares in amazement and heads back to his cave. Yes. I'm going to follow you. We're going to go that way. And that's his cave, I guess. So we're past his cave, right? What's this? Oh, God, he's back. Hi, man. What are you doing? Go away. <laughs> Go away. Be be confused again. Thank you. So, I want to make sure I have a safe place to land. And I think from here I'm supposed to head back down the mountain. I think. Uh, why am I heading down? Eagle be gone. Is that it? Shh, you're flying. Man, you just gotta you just gotta enjoy the ride, I guess. But I don't wanna like screw up, so how do I make it go away? Uh, oh, God, okay. Safety? Is that safe? Save. So we're going to go ahead and save over this one as day 14. And then down? Is that right? Bravely, you grasp the ice-laden rocks and attempt to scale the nearly vertical wall. Be careful, Gwydion. You congratulate yourself on successfully eluding the abominable snowman because this is the time for that. So down. Really? Really? Ugh. Let's congratulate ourselves again. So I guess over and down. Whoa! Ah, uh, okay, I needed to stop. So, what then? 
Really? Wow. So we're going to take this slower. Okay. Speed. Normal. Because... Yes. We're going to go ahead and save. Save. Uh, yeah, why not? Day 14. Do I go in the cave? There we go. Wow. Boy, are these caves dark. Where do I come out? Oh, oh. Save. Okay. Really? I'm glad I just saved. Wait, escape. <laughs> Sorry, leave you hanging there, man. Okay. Okay. So that's something. I feel like I should save again. What do you think? Too late. Do I climb this way? Nope. <laughs> nope. Don't save again. Okay, so that wasn't right. That wasn't right either. Wow. Well, wow. okay, okay, we're going to save again. Oh, God. I think I know where I'm supposed to go, though. I think I'm supposed to go here. And I'm just so grateful that it's, like, blocked off. That's, that's wonderful. I think I go back this way. Oh, I was right. Okay, save again, because you cannot save enough in these old retro games, because they will murder you. Climby, 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 like a spider. Not like a spider. Spiders are gross. Oh my god. I did it. Save. Is that it? Please tell me that's it. Oh. Oh, I'm so happy. Did I just go that way? Or am I stuck over there? How do I get out? You go that way? <laughs> oh my god, that was way more difficult than it needed to be. Uh, oh my god. Save again. Save. Cannot save enough. <laughs> So anyways, regarding my uh, con crud sickness, I am past coughing up my lungs, and now they just hurt. And I get that dry cough that I'm going to have for like 80 weeks, because I really probably should have paid more attention there. Glad I saved here. So anyway, yep. <clears throat> so I apologize for clearing my throat and sounding like a bullfrog. But it can't be helped. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was a close save. Because I hit the wrong button. Save. We are saving. And I'm behind a tree. Uh, I think this is safety. Save. So, I really don't think there's that much more to the game. Um, we already found out from the Oracle that I need to save my sister from a dragon. Really? Whoops, you slipped. No kidding. At least you didn't murder me this time. 
Dang. Okay. Well. Um. Is this a ravine? Yeah. You successfully fall for 20 meters before you hit the bottom. You get a 4.1 from the Russian judge. Ah, oh, topical humor. That's long, long past its expiration date. Okay, restore. I'm glad I just saved. Good call, me. Okay, so I can walk out there. That's good. <clears throat> Okay, look. Countryside of Daventry looks as if it had been once been beautiful, but now trees are charred, chasms, chasm, splits the earth, and wildflowers no longer grow. Nearby is an old broken down well that someone has filled with rocks. It's useless now. Oh, that's a bummer. That makes me sad. Look at well. It's useless. Like everything else in Daventry, the well gives a feeling of futileness. Oh, that's dark. Oh, wait, I can change my speed again. Can I? Speed. Fast. Okay. Much better. Oh, hi! Stare at the rundown shack upon the porch. A withered gnome rocks in a creaky old rocking chair, whistling a merry tune. The shack leans heavily to one side, and you wonder why it doesn't fall. Magic, perhaps? You speak directly to the old gnome. He chuckles softly to himself and replies, It's about time you got here, lad. I mean, Prince Alexander. Welcome home. Heaven knows we need you. daventry has been suffering for years now since that despicable dragon came. Alexander is a much better name than Gwydion. The old gnome narrows his eyes to slits and leans forward in his chair. That monster demanded the sacrifice of your poor sister, Princess Rosella. And I'm afraid time is running out. Your parents, the king and queen, are suffering such grief they have locked themselves in yon castle and refuse to see anyone. Staring intently at you, the gnome goes on. It's up to you, Alexander. Your country and family need you. It's written in the wind. Really? The wizened gnome relaxes and settles back in his chair. He begins whistling again. He doesn't care. <laughs> oh, you gaze sadly at the deteriorated castle. It's obvious that it was once proud and beautiful, but now its banners are torn, its stones and statue are crumbling, and the moat has been drained. It's as if no one cares anymore. Huge doors of the castle are bolted shut. Try as you might, you cannot open them. Knock. <laughs> I have no idea. <clears throat> really? Man, how do I... <sighs> okay. So obviously I have to go back to this screen. How to get there, man? How do I get there? That's obviously not right. <sighs> Is it? I don't know. Is it this way somewhere? That's not right. Man. Wonder if I like actually could run out of time. Stone wall travels to the north and south. You see if you can climb it, but find it too high. 
There's nothing of any interest on the other side of the wall anyway. Okay, so... Obviously, I'm kind of boxed in here. Push fence. Can I go through his house? Well, I can't listen to that annoying song. Okay. Um, that's not right either. Man. Look. All right, you know what? I'm still not feeling good. I'm still feeling pretty awful, actually. So I'm just going to finish this up in the next episode because just no. And uh, no, we're not listening to that song anymore. So someone vomited on the front steps. That's cute. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Comments are always welcome in the comment section below. If you can, please donate to Extra Life. It goes straight to the kids and straight to Children's Miracle Network. It's a great cause. Um, yeah, please. And then uh, I think that I'll finish this tomorrow, so that's good. Uh, so hit that like button if you like this video, and I hope to see you back for my next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.